Okay, the TVA Bio Walmart is set up and ready to go. I can't wait to watch all of my favorite Chinese cartoons on it. Now let's turn it on. What the? It's not turning on! <sighs> this won't do. Whatever shall I do? Hmm. Uh, time to wrench. We're going to make this remote turn on the TV over here. So, first, let's go ahead and give the TV a name. In the brick name, we'll type in TV. Don't name things using symbols or spaces. Next, we'll go to the remote and get working. You don't have to give the remote a name. Click on events. The input will be when we activate this remote or click on this remote. The target is the TV and we want it to change color because we are turning it on. I'll pick blue. Next, we're going to do the same event we just made, but this time we're going to give it a color effect. We'll use glow because that's the way the TV looks like it is when you turn it on. And finally, we'll do this one one more time, but this time we're going to make the TV light up. Since I chose the TV to turn blue, I think a blue light will look nicely with it. Okay, now we want to make this remote turn the TV off, too. So, let's make these three events again. Only this time, the output parameters will be the opposite. We want the TV to look like it's being turned off. So, a gray screen. No color effect. And... When we activated the TV, the color will be gray. So it looks like it's turned off, and the light, none. Alright. Now, in order to switch things on and off, we're going to add one last event. When we activate this brick, this brick will toggle events enabled. What event do we want toggled? All of them regarding the TV. 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4, and 5, type it in with a space in between each number. Now let's uncheck only the events that are supposed to make the TV turn off. Now click send. Mm -hmm. Okay, now let's test things out. Chinese cartoons. Time to get me a beer. Huh.